If you thought parking downtown couldn't get any more expensive, well, you might want to hit the brakes on that idea. I'm Natish Bassono next to a Green P lot. The Toronto Parking Authority wants to increase the hourly rates to lots like this, as well as on-street parking in some parts of the city. It's all part of a new proposal, and if they get it approved, that means you could be paying more sooner rather than later. The Toronto Parking Authority has reviewed its citywide on-street paid parking program for 2017 and is proposing to hit the gas pedal and drive the hourly rates up. Increases to green pee lots and on-street parking spaces aren't new, but this time we could see prices go up as much as 50%. Some of the select parts of the city could see this new paid parking in effect Monday to Sunday and ending at 9 p.m. The locations include the following. And among those are College Street and Danforth Avenue, areas that know all too well about parking troubles. The construction, as you know, has been happening on the south side of the street and now it's going to be coming back to the north side. To be implementing the price increase in conjunction with that, I just think it's like all the salt in the wounds. Ben Swirsky is the co-owner of Alchemy, which just opened its doors a month ago. They've just started adjusting to the construction, and like most small business owners facing obstacles, the hikes won't do them any favors. I would wish the, you know, provincial government may give, give the city more money so they don't have to charge extra for parking and those kind of deals. But right now, we gotta, we gotta do what we gotta do. We reached out to the Toronto Parking Authority for comment on this proposal. They didn't have anyone available to speak to us. We did, however, reach out to one city councillor who says the increases are justified. He says each neighbourhood should be treated equally and that the review reflects the areas with a growing demand. He says some of the streets haven't seen an increase in years. It is a revenue tool for the city and if we would like to contain costs and, and raise revenue when we can, um, then I don't think there's anything wrong with charging a little bit for parking. And while some business owners understand, change is never easy to come by. People, you know, are never good with change. Uh, you know, the, the rates before, you know, whether or not they were reasonable or not, one can debate that, but I think just the increase in general is not going to help, at least us. The city says it will do its part to make this transition easier. We've also been in active discussions with the TPA about what can we do uh, to, to phase this in over time so that there's a bit more time where the businesses are recovering from the, from the construction period. Now, the Toronto Parking Authority will present the proposal in front of the Government Management Committee on September 25th. And if it's approved, we could see these effects, these changes rather, come into effect as soon as this fall. Mr. Bassono, City News.